Today we are going to learn how to use the Learning Management System Schoology uh, to create an assignment. Uh, first thing you need to do is obviously have a, a Schoology account set up for yourself and for your students. Uh, assuming you've done that already, uh, you would need to go to your courses. Um, I have multiple courses set up. I'm just going to use uh, the Math Section 1. Um, and then there are two ways you could do this. Either add materials here or over on the toolbar on the left side you can choose that one. Um, lots of different options here but I'm going to focus today on assignments. First thing I would need to do, this is optional right here, but I could, I'm could i going to call it sample assignment. Um, create a description. How to make assignments. And uh, enable Dropbox, I always keep this clicked. You don't have to. This just allows the students to use their Dropbox to turn the assignment in. Maximum points. Uh, you can create um, how much you want it graded. Set as midterm. If you, especially in like uh, high school or upper level classes um, beyond high school, if the midterm is a certain percentage of the grades, you can just do that right here rather than having to go in and change the grades during the gradebook portion. A due date, it's really nice. You can actually create assignments in advance and have them due at specific times and it will actually put them on their calendar which is a nice um, aspect for the students because then they can kind of look at the calendar and see all their classes and what's due at any given time. Uh, and it also gives you a time frame that the assignment is due. So I think it, the kids kind of think it's funny in my class that they can turn a, an assignment in at 11.59. So you can have it set up for right after class. So if it's classwork that's due, uh, let's say that we want the assignment due at one uh, fifty-nine when the class is over. So they have to turn it in at that point, otherwise it marks it as late. Um, since I set that one to be during the school day, let's call that classwork. Grading options, you can either have it set up for specific um, quarters or semesters, however you have yours set up, trimesters. It can either be numeric or um, set up as A's, B's, C's. Um, and then you can also set a factor on how it weights the grade. And down here you can add files to your assignment. So if you have something created already, you can just attach it to it. You can give links so that students can um, maybe do research projects and you give them the links to the assignment. Um, and a couple options otherwise, uh, you can actually align these to certain standards, um, assign it to certain groups, lock it down. You can use the resources that are set up in Schoology where you save information. So maybe you have assignments saved from previous quarters. Um, and then another cool aspect of this is copy to courses. So because this is for my first hour math class, I can also add it to the second and third hour math class. And again, you can kind of tweak it. So obviously those two classes would not be at 159. Um, I'm not going to go ahead and change those times, but that's another neat thing that you can do. Um, I'm not actually going to save these for my courses, so I'm going to go ahead and say let's not do those right there. And once you create the assignment, it will show up down here. That went from two items to three items, so that just shows you that it added it right there. And when I click on that, this is what it looks like for students. And again, students all have a Dropbox that they can turn their assignments into. And I hope this has helped you learn how to use Schoology to create assignments for your students.